guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl drew some stuff and i'm back with another video i feel like that's the only intro that ever stuck because i had another one i was watching one of my videos like one of my past videos from like six or seven months ago and i literally was like what is this intro like <laughs> it was like a whole different intro than the one i do now i don't know but it is currently 10 48 it's almost 11 o'clock and I woke up at like nine or so and I am about to eat. Y'all saw my plate. Um, this right here is Mahi Mahi burgers and it's a Mahi Mahi burger. And this is just cinnamon raisin bagel. And this is my smoothie and I added peanut butter. I was like gonna do like in editing, I was gonna like, oh, let me just do a voiceover and not talk, but like I have been loving talking to the camera lately i just have been loving it like if y'all see me looking the other way it's because i'm looking at my laptop i'm about to find something to watch i was watching megan last night which if y'all know y'all know but the movie was good i rented it for 20 dollars on like the microsoft store um because my laptop is the hp so um it was really good it was 20 dollars. i don't think i said that but it was 20 dollars it's really, really good. I love the movie. I'm actually about to watch it again tonight because, like, it was such a good movie. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I think, I don't know. I'm looking at my watch later to see what I'm about to watch. I don't know. I've been loving Chloe Yasmin lately, which if y'all really watch every single one of my videos, y'all already know that I've been, like, locked in with her videos and stuff like that. But I've just been loving her lately. Like, even more, I guess I should say. Because, you know, for me, I go through ebbs and flows. Like, I think even with, like, you know, friendships and stuff, every, like, relationship goes in ebbs and flows. And sometimes, like, you don't want to watch a certain show or you don't want to watch a certain content creator. And then you like, oh, wait, I love this content. And then you come back to it. So I've been, like, loving. I've been loving just, like, weekly vlogs in general. This is not a weekly vlog. Oh, my gosh. I've been talking for two minutes and never said what the, this video is. This is a Sunday reset routine. This is my Sunday reset routine. And I basically do this every Sunday. Like, I'm low-key, I do this every single day. But, yeah, I have, like, a couple things planned. So, it's going to be, like, pretty active and stuff like that. I feel like these last couple vlogs have been more of me, like, in the house, chilling. And not really doing a ton. But I'm going to take you guys to, like, some stores. Well, one store. Because hopefully I only have to go to one. But, yeah, I'm about to eat. And then I'm checking with you guys, like, to talk to you guys about the plan of the day and stuff later. So this right here is Neg Champa and it smells so 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 good and it's just really nice to like clean the you know just any stench or anything in the house and um, it's really good for also your body. I don't really know exactly what <laughs> but yes so I um, found some at Whole Foods my mom loves it and it just smells really good so I would highly suggest you know for the little Sunday reset routine. Okay, guys, so I just wanted to give you guys, like, some tips and stuff like that. Um, like, a tip, I guess. I'm about to sort these Black Eyed Peas right here. My mom said that she wanted, um, Black Eyed Peas. 
so these are so much less expensive than the can band. I know some people, you know, um, don't know stuff like this. So I definitely want to like include more stuff like this in, in my videos and just giving like young women, especially women who are married or live alone, you know, tips and stuff to save money. And these black eyed peas, I don't know how much they were, but I can put on the screen how much they are in comparison to the canned beans. And it is um, one pound, so 16 ounces of beans in this bag. And I'm going to sort these. And sorting them means taking out any rocks um, because there are rocks in the beans because, you know, they do come from the earth, the ground. And sometimes there's like, you know, different blemishes in certain beans. So you do want to take those out. And that is how I was taught to sort by my mother. Um, ignore this pickle patch because just ignore it. Yeah. But um, yeah, so that's what I'm about to sit here and do. And then I'm going to soak them in like four or five cups of water for about, typically you do it three or four hours, but you can do overnight, which I really should have did this last night, but I did it. So it's fine. So I'm just going to do it right now. of trash <laughs> this is recycle at the bottom though but this is a trash so we're about to take that out the story of why i don't take out the trash anymore in our condo <laughs> so basically okay so basically oh gosh everything is just falling right now So essentially, one time I went down to take the trash out and literally the a rat jumped out of the trash container. And I said, nope, I'm never doing this again. I'm gonna stay in my feminine role and do other things in the house, but I'm not taking the trash anymore. But here I am doing it again. I'm about to just put the trash right here. Like I'm not gonna lie, cause I really am scared to go in there. Like it's like a area for trash specifically. I'm scared to go in there, I'm not gonna lie. So I'm gonna let my dad do it. And I'm not doing it anymore. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Notice. <laughs> I'm leaving it right there for him to put it in there. But yes. So, <laughs> okay, so I'm back from Target. Oh, yeah, I went to Target. I didn't film at all because, I don't know, like, being in Target, actually being in any store is so stressful. And then, literally, Target never has any carts. Like, when I'm telling you they never have any carts, like, I see people walking around in Target with carts. I can never find one. I look around the whole store. There's no carts, no empty carts. And that's really why I don't like going to Target. At least the one by me because it's always so busy. Like, literally, every time I go, it's packed again. But anyways, I went to Target to get a Swiffer. A Swiffer? <laughs> I literally love these things. Like, they're such a great invention, you know? And then I got, like, the more of the wet pads and stuff because it, the, the actual thing only comes with five in it. 
And I'm probably about to use five just clean house today because the floors are, the floors are just, and then I got this vacuum. The reviews were hit or miss, so you probably wonder, why did you buy it in the review? Listen, all the other vacuum, I think this one was like $60 or so. All the other ones are like $300, like, I'm just not, I, I would never pay $300 for a vacuum in good conscience. Oh, and I also got this Beyond Meat um, jerky because I, where did I see, I saw this somewhere and I was like, I just cha I cha happened to see it in Target by chance. And I want to try it out, so actually I'm going to try it out right now. And I got Starbucks too. Oh, no. Nah. I was, about to, I was about to say my order, but I feel like just if you watch all my videos, you already know my Starbucks order. So if you don't know it, then I don't know. Okay. It smells good already. It smells good. Okay, it says slow roast, slow roasted and kettle cooked. Okay, ten grams of protein. I need more protein. That's a um. Okay, it smells too soy. What's that gonna say? Okay, I'm gonna try this. I'm kind of scared. <laughs> How do you eat jerky? Okay, this is good. Hmm. You want to try it then? Yeah. <laughs> My dad is having a hard time today. It tastes pretty good, actually. Classic toy. <laughs> you don't like it? The flavor is there. I don't know. It's kind of interesting. I don't know. It's kind of hard.
come back. Ooh, it hurts. Look at them at it. Oh my gosh, this is so atrocious. This is such an atrocious hand. <laughs> this hand is awful, I'm not gonna lie. Look at the hand, y'all. It's literally atrocious. <laughs> I don't even know. Like, we're sitting here playing spades. I um cooked dinner. I made I already showed y'all earlier, but I made the um what are those called? Candy There's too many different types of beans. Black, Black eyed peas. And rice. And I made cornbread too. How'd y'all like the dinner? It was good. <laughs> Delicious. That was a grown woman, man. Yes, yeah, so we got two thumbs up from my parents. But yeah, it was really good. It was more spicy than I expected it to be. But I put, I didn't even put that much cayenne. I don't know. I guess I put more than, but it wasn't like, it's not super spicy, but it's good. Yeah. Plus, spice is good, though. It does help um with your immunity a lot. Helps with immunity. But, um, yeah, right now we are just playing spades, and after I cooked, I cleaned the dishes and everything like that, and I don't know what else I did. I, um... That part. <laughs> Dang, why you got a lot of books? I vacuumed my last video. See, I had the ace of, of club, I mean, of diamonds. Did y'all tie top. again? Yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. You got eight. Oh, you won. You got eight. Oh, okay. I have two books, y'all. I literally, I had two the first game and one the second. I don't know. I don't know what it is. It was inactively distributed to me. That's two out of three. Yeah, we should play again. But, um, yeah, so we're just playing Chase right now, which I said like five times. Yeah, they all. My dad keeps trying to get us the only first of what games we play only part of the deck, half of the deck. But the thing is, with that, if y'all play spades, which y'all should, because if you're black, you don't play spades. What are you doing? <laughs> also, you know, if you're not black watching my channel, that's okay too. But um, yeah, no. they were teaching me. My parents were teaching me how to um shuffle. Like I can kind of shuffle. She can't. <laughs> I can shuffle at an okay, uh, it's, it's, it's alright, but, um, yeah, I just pretty much vacuumed and stuff, and now the floors look so nice, like, they look like HGTV right now, they look so, so, so nice, tomorrow, I think, tomorrow, I think I'm gonna, um, tackle my room, you wanna do? Oh, he's got it. Yeah, so tomorrow I think I'm gonna tackle my room. Please tackle. Yeah, I know my room looks very bad. My dad, <laughs> Mara, have you seen it? It looks. It's always like chaotic. I really need to declutter my um whatever that's called, my closet and stuff like that, and take out stuff that's like summer stuff because I have like summer dresses. Like I'm the type of person that never puts away the stuff from the season. Like I just keep everything from the season and stuff. I'm just like, oh, I'm going to wear it next season, but I need to get rid of it. Yeah, but the vacuum had mixed reviews online, but it's a pretty good vacuum. I mean, you get what you pay for. So, like, if you expect, like, a $300 vacuum, like, that's like getting a, a one-star hotel and expecting five-star. <laughs> like, you, you don't, you're surprised when cockroaches start running out. Like, Bro, you pay fifty dollars a night for that. Like, you know what you about to get. <laughs> don't do it, Brandon. But yeah, we're not. <laughs> I think honestly, this is the end of my video. So thank you guys so much for watching because I'm not doing anything else. And yes, thank you guys for watching. Subscribe, all of that fun stuff. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.